Hello, welcome back to 1001 Beers, you must try before you die. I'm here in my hotel room in California. Uh, I've got some more beers to review. Um, uh, three more beers, which is exciting, I'll do one at a time. Uh, the first beer, uh, first brewed in 2002, it's 7%. Um, which is strong, but this is sort of American beers. Uh, it's Drake's IPA, and here it is. I've got a nice large bottle here. Looking forward to drinking this. There's a whole, even though it's a large bottle, it's only actually a pint. Um, it says. We'll see how we go with that. Put that down for a minute. Um, so this one it says um, with a deep amber golden colour. It's slightly cloudy. Drake's IPA is a big American West Coast interpretation all the way, thick with citrus, grapefruit and herbal hop aromas. The flavours are likewise big and hoppy, though it's well balanced with a long, lingering, tart finish. Um, so I'm just trying to work out where in California it's from. It doesn't say. What does it say the bottle? Anything interesting? Uh, so it's here. Oh, San Leandro, California. This classic West Coast IPA is a harmonious fusion of resinous pine and, or, uh, and orange peel, cascading over a backdrop of lightly toasted caramel and brisk bitterness. Revel in the bright aromatics and let Drake's IPA show you why the West Coast is the best coast. Right, well, wow, that's good. I like the design. That's a solid design. Drake's Brewing Company. So let's crack this open on the table here. I've got my nice little cup here. Uh, not exactly uh, classy, but I didn't bring glassware with me all the way to the US. Okay. Okay, so. Can't really see the colour for now, but we'll, we'll come on that in a minute. So let's go for the smell first of all. It smells quite hoppy. It doesn't smell like 7% though. Unless it's kind of got a light hops in it. Uh, I don't know if it says what hops it uses. Let's have a quick look. It just says. Just says, oh, uh, Cascade in Columbus. Uh, it says it's got a hefty 65 IBUs, uh, which means it's going to be quite bitter, but let's give it a go. Cheers. That is quite bitter. Not as bitter as a double IPA. That's really nice, actually. Um, it's slightly on the bitter, bitter side, but it's still quite um, easygoing. Uh, not it's not overly hoppy. I think it's just about right. Uh, the interesting reason why it's called Drake's uh, Brewing Company is that uh, the brewery logo was uh, and labels were created uh, originally named after the Golden the, uh, Sir Francis Drake. Basically, um, it says it was originally the Lynn's Brewing Company and they use a nautical theme based on Sir Francis Drake. And a lot of the la labels and logos are based on the Golden Hind. The brewery was bought and they they took all the brand names and the logos and they renamed it Drake's Brewing. So, uh, and this is their IPA. Uh, it says here, um, so they changed the yeast. Um, not much else to say. It won, it won a, a chocolate coin, a gold medal at the Great American Beer Festival in 2002. And this was first brewed, so it's actually doing quite well. Let's go for another taste. Yeah, not bad at all. That's a solid uh, American hoppy, hoppy West Coast pair, I'd say. Not a great deal more to say about that one. So I think I'll leave it there. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you for another video you soon.